Hello there. To my surprise, the FTP clients can access all partitions mounted by the FTP server on the same local network, as per the fstab file. My videos on the PC are on partitions stb4 and stb5, and I want to stream them to the Android television. Let's stream. Sony Bravia Android TV with DU screen recorder. Start Explore File Manager. FTP. Long press on FTP Linux Wi-Fi. I am using the same user and password as for the Linux login. Scroll down to the MNT folder. Tap on STB5, the data partition, and scroll down to the Video Enhance project. A couple of years ago, I re-digitalized our old analog videos, aiming for the best quality possible, and then rendered them to MP4 using DivX or XVID codecs, which I prefer for video editing. The own folder, and start Squirrel 2 video. The squirrel kept eating all the peanuts intended for the birds, so we bought this squirrel safe domed contraption. Too near the fence. We'll move it out. Tap home. Start Cody. Videos. Files. Tap FTP Linux Wi Fi. Shows the Linux root. Navigate to the MNT folder. Tap STB4, the Windows partition. Scroll down to the Plex folder, which contains all the enhanced videos, though given a finer rendering with H.264 codecs, which I do prefer for streaming. I do not use the Plex server very much. Own folder. Start Square 3 video. Had moved the contraption another half a meter, so that the squirrel decided to climb the pole instead. So I decided to put Vaseline on the pole. Start the Squirrel 4 video. Yeah, too slippery. Tap home. Start VLC media player. Browsing. Local network. Go to the right to local favorites and open SMB Wi-Fi. And navigate to the MNT folder. Tap STB4. Down to Plex. Down to the own folder. And start Squirrel 4 video again. Yeah, too slippery. So the squirrel decided to venture jumping the one and a half meter to the top of the domes. Can it get to the peanuts? No. It has tried a couple of times, but has now given up. Tap home and stop the screen recording. Yes, both FTP and SMB clients on the local network can access the partitions that the server has mounted. If you are using SE Linux, I suggest using permissive setting. That's it. I hope you enjoyed it and thank you for watching.